whoever you are, whatever problem we've got, we can settle it too. I suggest you lower your weapon. God Almighty, you motherfucker. Good to see you too. Sam, where are you going? Come on, you're not still mad, are you? Got anything that'll cure a headache? I'll see what I can do. Seems to be the problem, Sheriff. This man tells me you killed Jack Gates this morning. Shot him down like a feral dog, he says. What's so funny? I was only doing what was right. Murder. I guess we just don't see eye to eye. Don't you move another inch. Thought you'd be thanking me. Stopped you from having to clean up a mess today. Just lower your gun and no one else has to get hurt. Ask you one question. Why'd you shoot him in the leg? Why didn't you just kill him? I missed.
Mind if I have a drink? So where are we going? What's the plan? I just want to know what you're thinking about. What's that? Billy, would you calm down? If you're gonna follow me, quit your yapping. I damn shot myself in the leg. God damn it, Billy. Thank you. Uh, uh, uh. Pull it together, Billy. Grab that stick, stand up. We're losing time, Billy. Come on. Uh. Thought she was dead. Why'd it take you so long to dig that money back up? Suppose I didn't need it. How'd you last that long? What was it, two years? It 
something like that. But now I do need it. You know that bank about five miles east of here? Owned by that fella Crazy Eye Jones? Of course I do. You know what I'm thinking? Howdy, sir. I'd like to make a withdrawal. How much? Four hundred dollars. Might as well take more than four hundred. Four hundred is enough. I want them all. Let's go, Billy. Something catching your eye? Yeah, let me see that watch there. Sir, are you all right? Yeah. How much for the watch? Uh, twelve dollars. And the hat? Seven. All right. Let's make an even point. Thank you very much. You boys have a good day. Sir, you as well. And uh, take care of that watch there, mister. Man isn't whole if he doesn't have his watch. Hat. Thanks for the hat. Don't mention it. That watch looks familiar. Yeah, it's been a while since I've had a new watch. The old one meant so much to me. What happened to it? Come to think of it, I lost it around the same time I lost you. What happened? <sighs> well, that's a loaded question. Uh, where to begin? But when the gang arrived. Yeah, I guess that's a good place. I was on my own till the gang found me. They did what they did, but then I escaped. 
up until Jack Gates found me. <laughs> I guess it was lucky that he found me then. Do you recognize any of them? Uh, I think some of them were members of the Loons Gang. Sir. Breathe, son. What is it? Two men robbed the bank this morning. They took 400 with them. Sorry, sir. There was nothing I could do. God damn it! That's fine, I understand. You say, did you get a good look at him? I heard one of them say a name. What was it? Cold. How many of them do you recognize? About five of them or so. After Loons died, Jack Gates took over. Well, I think so. It was hard to tell. Five total. One gone. What about the rest of them? I think I saw him on one of posters. I haven't seen anything about the Loons Gang. Sure they haven't been caught? Doubt it. What do you know, Billy? Hey, I've told you everything I know, okay? Look, I'll help you. But I'm not about to go on some crazy revenge adventure. I've got bigger things to deal with. Like what? Robbing another damn bank? Hey, that was your idea! Yeah, it was. And I'm never going back to that again. So let me ask you again, Billy. What else do you know? Why do you assume that I know anything? Because I know you, Billy! What else do you know? Fine. I knew two of the Loons Gang members a while back, but they left a long time ago. How long ago did they leave? I don't know. Sometime after the ambush, I think. They might have known a couple of them, but I never thought it my business to ask. Of course it's your business. They almost killed you, Billy. Don't you want to find them? Suppose I did at one point. But that was two years ago, Sam. At some point, I just forgot about it, and I moved on with my life. You should too. You know I can't do that. Did I ever tell you about this man I knew once? He was a real tough fella. Never let anyone get in the way of what he wanted. But that got the best of him. See, because one day someone stole something from him. On the outside he looked alright, but on the inside he was all torn up about it. Those men took everything from me, Billy.
to know what it's like to lose everything. Yeah. I might know. Howdy, Sheriff. What are we gonna do for you? Look, two men. Cowboy looking fellas. Seen anything? Uh, yeah, as a matter of fact, I have. Uh, two men came in just yesterday. One bought a watch and the other a hat. You know what direction they went in? I believe they headed west of here. Did they now? Well, have a good day. Sure you're looking for the right men, Sheriff? They didn't seem too off when I found them. Yes, I'm certain. Listen, about these men. What? Uh, well, it's nothing too important, you know. It's just, uh, I... Sam Colt. Don't worry, we go way back. What happened to your leg, Billy? No, uh... I was shot. You were shot? Uh, who did it? You never told us this. Uh, well, that's because, uh, I... <laughs> because I shot myself. <laughs> <laughs> you shot yourself? I wouldn't have expected anything else from you, Billy. That's exactly what I thought when he'd done it. Listen up. You don't talk unless you're told to talk, you hear? I do the talking, and you talk when I let you. Where'd you find this guy? James, <laughs> he was just trying to make a joke here. I'm a pretty smart fella if you haven't figured that out. Got a lot of stuff up in here. Might not be able to recollect. I was told you was once a part of the Loons Gang. Once. Not anymore. Exactly. That's why I was hoping you could help me. Just spit it out, son. Well, right after y'all left, they staged a robbery on the railroad east of the river. Yeah, I heard about that. And you know what happened when they tried? Well, I'll tell you. They stopped the train a little south of Dead Creek, but when they got to the vault, it was empty. How come it was empty? Well, because someone had already taken it just north of Dead Creek. Well, who took it? Me. So what's the issue? Well, the gang figured out, and I ended up with nothing. So I was hoping you fellas could help me find some of the men involved. And, before you answer that, let me 
ask another question. How come you three left the room scan? A little of this, a little of that. Such as? Is that your second question? No. Then I suggest you wait to ask that one. I need names. Let me ask you a question. Why do you care about men who stole from you two years ago? Nobody steals from me. So this revenge is fueled by the fact that you lost a couple of bucks? I don't have to explain to you why I want what I want. I just need you to give me names. You like cards, Sam? Depends on the game. Well, what game do you like? Blackjack. Blackjack? You have good taste. Now, I assume I'll deal because I'm the host. That okay? I like blackjack myself. I've always admired how the dealer has the advantage. What about you? Yeah, it's fun, I guess. Hit me. It's a simple game that can lead to difficult decisions. Wouldn't you say so? Suppose. Hit me. Sometimes the king isn't always the best card. Or sometimes it is. Wanna play another? Sure. Another reason I like blackjack is because you only see one of the dealer's cards. You don't know what the other is. It creates a sense of unease and mystery. You don't know everything that's going on. It's almost as if you're being misled. Hit me. If you think about it, all this game comes down to is a bit of luck. Maybe you'll win this one. Third time's the charm. And even if you do, no hard feelings. I'm still enjoying the moment. Hit me. Pretty good. Tricky situation. The bus and I'd win. Enjoying the moment. Fuck you! Thought you said you left the loons game. No, you did. And they're gonna be here any second now when they find you, they're gonna kill you. When are they gonna come here? What? How soon are they gonna be here? Why the hell would you care? Cause I hate waiting. What have you done? Saved our skins. You're welcome. Didn't you just hear them? Men are coming to the spot at any moment. What are you gonna do when they...
Where's James? This better be the best fucking argument I've ever heard. Give me one good reason why I shouldn't shoot you right now. Because. I'd have to clean up a whole lot of bodies. Sheriff? I thought we talked about this. Shouldn't be here, I was only doing what was right. Are killing all those boys in there? You could say that. Someone please explain to me what the hell is going on here. Listen, Jones. Got most of the money I took from you back there. I got something extra I think can help make it all right. I'm tied up, got guns to my head, there's nothing I can do. Just come over here. Just reach into my left chest pocket. And there's a map. Follow it, find a chest full of cash and bonds. Why are you giving this to me? Just some extra for your troubles. Expect me to forgive you just like that. Look, Jones. You get to that X, you don't find anything, come right back, find me, and do whatever you was planning to do today. Give me a minute. What do you think, boys? I like it. I think we take it. I agree. Situation is more than we bargained for anyways. Are you too serious? This man robbed us a few days ago, and you're going to trust him like that? He said he'd give us all the money back. This map is a sure thing. Just look at it. I agree. I think we take the map and go. We decided to take the map. Well, you best believe if this doesn't lead to anything, I'm coming back with ten times the amount of man. Fair enough. Money's by the door. Sheriff, if I could, I'd like to clear things up. Please do. See, I meant no trouble with the gates issue. As I said, I was just doing what was right. Two years ago, my family was ambushed by the Looms Gang. I was the only one that escaped. Five men there. I recognized one of them as Jack Gates. I've been tailing him ever since. Finally ran into him a couple days ago, and naturally you stumbled across the only witness other than myself. And you went after me. I've got large amounts of respect for a man that puts his life on the line for justice. But I believe I was fulfilling mine. If you don't agree, by all means, hang me for my crimes. I gotta go take a piss. That was a touch of soy, Colt. Well, I mean, if it wasn't about us, I probably would have believed you. Well, I'm glad you enjoyed it. 
but you probably should have been paying closer attention. Colt, unless you want your dear friend Billy's brains blown out, I suggest that you surrender. Will it be, Colt? Yeah, what was that? If I get myself up, you let Billy go. Alright, you got a deal. Now you're probably wondering why I asked you to come out here. I'll tell you. Colt's been looking all over for you. Rumor has he's coming into town at 10 this morning. Now I say, I pretend to be a prisoner and we head out to those trees over there. What do you say? Or I could just kill him when he gets in range. Now that would be no fun. But he doesn't know about you, right? That's right. Billy, I really think it best if you just stay back and let me handle this. No. No, I like my plan better. Gee, thanks, Sam. You know, I really thought you were smarter than this. What do you expect me to do, help you out? Here, get these off me. You know, I was charmed by your little story. Just thinking about the pain you suffered watching your family get murdered. You know, I was there and I knew a little bit more of the story. After you buried the money you stole from us, that was rightfully ours, you came back and saw your family there, hopelessly murdered. As you probably already know, we took back what was rightfully ours. For the next two years, we were looking for you just to make sure you kept your little mouth shut. You probably thought I was on your side, didn't you? That I died saving your family? Well, I did it. You know, just a few days ago, I saw Jack Gates. We got together, and we were planning to finally take you out after all these years. We heard you were coming to town, but you got there before we knew. You killed Jack Gates. They didn't care to see me alive. To be honest, I'm still not really sure why I expected anything differently. All you cared about was what was in my head. After we robbed the bank, you even bought me a hat. How kind. Trying to warm me up. Trying to get me to talk. Well, sometimes you just make it too easy. What was that? Why did you betray us? Oh, nothing personal. We just had a plan and I had a specific job. Your fault for trusting someone you barely knew. Look at me. Look at me. You know what your problem is? You're chaotic. You're a mess. You don't know what you're doing. You don't know where you're going. But I do. Some people never get to experience pain in their lives. Guess it was lucky your wife got to feel it once in her miserable life. Now it's your turn. Any last words?
I always knew you was one to take the easy way out, Billy. Excuse me? Shoot my man while he's down. What? I'm sure your friends here will think all high and mighty of you for shooting a man while he's tied up and in the dirt. Oh, you want to die a hero? Fine, I'll let you. Last chance to not make a fool of yourself. Try and think funny. I'll shoot you dead before you can think another thought, you hear? I've been chasing you for 15 odd miles, and let me tell you, that's a long time to go without taking a piss. Can you shut up? I lost my train of thought. I wasn't sure about your story, but after hearing that lunatic talk, it became pretty clear what was truth and what was lies. If you could, could you please keep this between you and me? I think it would be hard to explain this to the marshal. Yes, sir. So, what's next? Well, I've got one thing in mind, but then I'm not sure how long my trick is going to fool Jones. Jones has more money than brains. Think we'll meet again if you're caught? 
Let's hope not. Hey, Sheriff! Why just shoot Billy in the leg? Why didn't you just kill him? I missed. Look at me. 